hey guys welcome back or welcome to my channel i hope you guys are having a wonderful day and a wonderful life of course on today's video i'm going to be unboxing a kindle paperwhite 11th edition in agave green it took about three weeks for me to get it because i think this is like a popular color that i guess isn't well stocked or whatnot like the black ones so it did take a while to get here but she's finally here Please come ever leave me. I prefer reading electronically versus reading on the real thing, right? The only reason is because of my risk. There's times that I feel really uncomfortable. So I find the Kindle to be perfect for someone like me, especially because I'm able to add a pop socket on there and just read all night long without my wrist hurting and my neck hurting. I'm just gonna skip over this tutorial part because this isn't my first Kindle. I'll show you guys my last one that I bought in a couple of clips after this one. But here are my books that I have in my library. I have some Audible books on here as well. I actually did read this one, honestly forgot what it was about. But you can just connect your Bluetooth earbuds or headphones and just listen to it. You can still skip over some chapters and, and you can also speed up the, the audio as well. I kind of stopped reading B stars like a long, long time ago because honestly, I don't know, it just it doesn't do it for me anymore. But I like this little feature here that you're able to do on manga or manhwa. So this manga is getting animated this year. It's basically a Cinderella inspired slow burn historical romance with a paranormal twist set in Taisho era Japan. I haven't read it yet. This is just a sample just so I can kind of get a, a taste on what's to come. So this one is like one of my favorite, favorite, favorite book series ever. It's actually going to be my third time reading the whole series again. I think there's six books out and it's actually originally up from Wattpad, but it's not one of them crazy Wattpad stories. This one's based in 19th century London and it's basically just a girl trying to find her freedom and she basically encounters someone that can help her find freedom. I don't want to spoil anything, but check it out down below. Of course, it's a romance because all my books that I read are romance, okay? This one is actually my current read. I'm on the fourth book. I think I'm on the fifth book now, but it's actually originally a manhwa from this app called Manta. I'm actually caught up already with the manhwa, but they just haven't finished it yet. So I decided to read the novel and I would highly suggest to start off with the novel first for a lot of manhwas if you're able to get your hands on them first and if they're available in English.
this is my very first kindle this one's a 2018 version just a regular original kindle that i bought a few years back i'm actually going to be customizing it soon because i'm giving this to my friend as a gift so stay tuned to that video I really do prefer these paper white series versus the regular ones because of the warm light, the bigger screen, and the battery. Can I talk about the battery real quick? The 2018, the battery, I think it would only last me for like three days, I believe. And this one has lasted me longer than that. So I've noticed a big difference when it comes to this Kindle versus the 2018 version. So let me know in the comments if you're a Kindle user as well. What do you read? And do you have any recommendations for Les Mois? Please let me know down in the comments. Let me know what you guys think about this video. And I'll see you on the next one. Deuces.